A good teacher is going to say, you still don't have it, you're going to have to take that again. And that's what kept happening to me. And I finally got it the other day, and I was like, oh, no, I'm about to be cool. <laughs> Turn the TV on, and just call, sit back, and watch a movie. <laughs> so, I got a little head on the head on the end. So I'm just, you, you're not going to take it through this week in the is what I was thinking. And before I knew the time had passed, and I said, thank you, Jesus. And then I was like, you mean this one? Because <laughs> I passed it. And that's what this is about, y'all. And that's why I'm so excited uh, about my sister because I saw for a moment, the, you know, a quick moment where it was like, she was shook for a quick second. And then I watched her get her fright. Hallelujah. And, when I, and it was almost like um, those, like, you know, movies where it's a superhero, like in um, the Transformers. I can't remember which one of Transformers it was. It was down at the end. And it was like, oh my God, did they kill it? And then all of a sudden you see it's like, <laughs> and it's not, I mean, my old friend, that's in the channel. And it was like, and then it got up, and it was like, it got up, it got up. And I thank God, and that's what I watched happen. Amen. I watched the fall for a minute, and then it was almost like, Lord said, it shall not be. Y'all right now. Lord said, it shall not be. Just go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> and then I can you know, I got my sisters together. I got my fight back. I got my strength back. Because what the enemy wants to do, he wants to get you down and he wants you to get consumed with the fact that you were down there. Who cares about that? I don't care if you were down there for 50 minutes or four days. The thing that matters is did you get up? Yeah. 
that's what she's doing. Yeah. She's shaking stuff Thank off right now. And it's not just about her, it's about us. Amen. And if we don't learn the lesson, it could be us in that bed tomorrow. Amen. But she might be going through this so that we don't have to go through it. And that's what it's all about. It's like, I'm, I, I took it on. So now we can walk on. That's one less thing we have to handle, we have to worry about. So y'all get the lesson. Stay faithful. I could keep talking to the young people, and I know they think I'm crazy, probably, about going on and on. Just read, just read, just read. Well, I got it honest, because she asked me every day. But the reason why I keep asking them about it, did you read, is because it would be as crazy as if you went your whole junior, senior year without taking a textbook and without opening one. You don't plan in the past. And it's the same thing if you don't open your Bible and spend time with God. You can't, you can't plan, you don't plan to be successful. You don't plan to win against the enemy if you're not reading your Bible, if you're not praying and spending time with God. You are setting yourself up for failure. So that's why I keep asking. Because you won't make it. Amen. You won't make it. Amen. And you won't have that kind of steadfastness that you would be like that transfer you just stay down with them. <laughs> they say, well, God is going to get up. And it's not God's fault that they did. Amen. It's because when we don't get up, y'all, it's our fault. Amen. It's our fault. You know, and we have to stop making it seem like God is not able because we don't do what we're supposed to do. When we know what God tells us to do, he, when, if we do what he tells us to do, you'll be victorious. Rather, the world recognizes it as victory or not, you'll be victorious. So, y'all, let's stay encouraged today, as my grandmother would say. Stay encouraged and let's stay on this path. Let's be determined to fight. Not just so that we can make it through, but so that our brothers and sisters can make it through. That's what it's about, about the strong bearing the infirmities of the weak. Do you want to be the one that's weak forever being, you know, having to be the one that somebody is bearing? At some point, you should be the one that's, you know what, no, I'm, I got this. I got you, let's pray, right? And that's so important. Let's stay. Thank you, man. Thank you, Jesus.